guys, Jackie Jean here. All right, so I'm gonna just kind of dive right in, show you a little bit of these light effects and the presets that I've got going with it. The, um, you know, I've got just basically five clean edits, a couple hazy matte edits in this, and then some uh, light effects as well. And then I do have my go-to black and white that is the most similar to my go-to black and white in Photoshop so I actually really love this black and white preset so I'm going to show you that as well. So, Alright, this one is straight out of the camera made sure to reset it and we'll just do a couple of clean edits real quick so that way I can just kind of show you those. Now depending on where your exposure is you run the preset and then you can adjust adjust the exposure if you like the darker moodier or if you like brighter. Um, so that's the only thing that I would change with the presets. I'm gonna clean it at five. We've got the hazy mat right here which I kinda like adding that exposure down just a little bit on that one. Hazy mat with a blue green tint. I like this one as well. I'm gonna bring the exposure down just a touch and now to add the light source. So we have the center little light source right here. You can see before and after. We've got there and then the one thing that you got to remember too with these light sources is they're not going to work with every image and you want to make sure that it's going to match where the light is originally coming from in the picture when you add it. Whereas this one the light was up top. It was overcast, however, you know, the sun is hiding behind the clouds and it was right up top there and as you can see the light's just coming down right on them. Whereas I've got, let's see, let's got the left orange glow, which that kind of works, but it's still not in the exact direction. And then we've got that's left orange glow, got the right orange glow got the large one. Now this one obviously isn't going to work for this so you'd have to pick an image where it's going to work for it. We've got the right orange large glow right there and that one actually kind of works a little bit. But I'm going to go ahead and let's go and reset that. I'm going to use the just the center light source. I really like that one. We'll add that hazy blue green preset to it. Just bring down the exposure and bam, there's before and after. And I wanted to show just a few different pictures as well. And as you can see in the intro of this video, there was a few before and afters as well. This kind of gives you an idea too of how the light goes and you know different exposures and different pictures as well because I wanted to pull from different ones. And again, I really like, whoops, that one actually works for this. So this is the left orange glow. We can do clean. Let's do clean edit two. Just bring down that exposure just a, a touch and before and after right there. If you wanted a different look, reset. You can do the center light source. Got that hazy matte. This one bring that exposure down and maybe even add a little more contrast but before and after there. Alright, move on to this one. I'm going to reset this and this is the go-to black and white and with this one again like I really kind of like it as is but if you wanted to make it moodier just bring down that exposure add a little contrast and you're good to go. All right, so we've got this shot right here and let's see again you can kind of scroll over I like the preview box we've got that left orange the right and just with the direction of the Sun it was kind of behind him more towards this side just because you can see where the light is falling on him so we could do the right orange glow right there then let's add edit 5. I like 
uh, richer images as far as like the brightness so I just bring that exposure down just a touch and here we've got before and after all right and so I wanted to pull another image too that was a little bit different that didn't have that kind of lighting that some of the other ones had this was just a total foggy day let's go ahead and just reset this and this one's cool because well obviously that's not going to work so you don't want that center one but I do like that small orange glow right there and let's see I'll do more of a matte finish with this one do the hazy matte blue green and bam we've got before and after so that kind of gives you an idea of how to use the presets and what I have in there, and it will be available soon. Thanks, guys.